Hey, what's up, guys? This is my guide on how to watch HDR content on YouTube. The first thing that you're going to need to do is have a HDR compliant monitor. The second thing is go under display settings, use HDR, check this box. This is for Windows 11, Windows 10, it's going to be in a different spot, but you should be able to type in HDR into the start menu and find this. Um, then you're going to need to check auto HDR, HDR video streaming, use HDR. Um, yeah, so the next step is you need to turn on use graphics acceleration when available inside of Google Chrome or whatever browser that you use. Uh, I only know about Google Chrome. This is how I do it. Um, yeah, so the other program that you're going to need is something called Auto HDR Force. What this program does, it allows you to run a specific executable in HDR permanently. So... For example, uh, Google Chrome. If, I, if I'm watching HDR content on YouTube, I want Chrome to be in the forced mode. I've already done it, um, but I will show you for the sake of this video how to do it. Uh, let's see. Can we open the file location? Here we go. Open file location. All right, so what you're going to do is... Copy the name of the executable, put it at the end of the path, then copy the path, and then put it in here. And just hit yes, yes for both of these things and you'll be done. It, just hit Y enter and it'll it'll do it automatically. I won't do it here because it's gonna mess up my stuff, but I can show you with um for example uh Pod. Black Ops 1, and this is the file that I want. I'm going to copy that. Backslash paste, and then copy this. And double click that, right click, enter. Yes, yes. Boom. And that's how easy it is to add a program. Um, so then you should be good to go when it comes uh, to base HDR content on YouTube. As you can see, my content that's in 8K HDR. Um, if you ever decide to change back to SDR, just go to display settings, turn it off. No. My screen should look a little grayed out because of my 10-bit, but as you can see here, I, it only goes up to 4K on standard definition videos when the HDR is in 8K. It's not going to process any further than that. Um, so if you're not seeing it in 8K, that's why. Um, I hope this helps. All right, bye.